If you buy a MacBook Air, you're a fucking moron. <laughs> Very disappointed with them. Um, they've been annoying the sh crap load out of me. Now, this rant is actually about Apple's return policy. It's very annoying and frustrating for someone like me. Um, the people I've spoken to at Apple, actually, the senior advisors, they're all cool. Problem is, behind the scenes, the engineers, the people who m make all the calls, they're the, really the problem to me. They're the ones that are like, I ain't getting his money back. Screw him, man. He's going to figure it out on his own. I just want my money back. The point of this video is, Apple, please fix this problem for me. Fix your return policy. I feel like they're just sitting on their asses and not giving a shit about my problem because it's taken way too long. There seems to be a dark hate for Apple and their products. This is the number one thing that I hate about Apple. It's probably the number one reason people hate Apple because a new product or new service or new feature comes out and Lord Steve Jobs talks about it and everybody thinks it's the best thing ever. Oh my God, Apple invented multitasking. Oh, I love you, I love you. <laughs> if you buy a Mac, you can upgrade the RAM, SSD and so on. And the prices that Apple asked for those upgrades are just completely ridiculous. They're just completely out of their mind, to be honest. The cost of Apple products are generally more expensive. And the reason behind that is because you're paying for the name. You're paying for the logo on the back of the device. And that's about it. In terms of technology speaking, um, the components which are made inside the Apple products are actually made by other uh, people, especially their competitors like Samsung. Uh, which I find kind of ironic, but um, a lot of people tend to buy Apple products because they're Apple. That's it. Apple have taken the attitude of uh, patenting everything, including a rectangular uh, device with a little button at the end, and have patented that and sued Samsung a lot of money for that. Apple customers are completely blindfolded um, about other products and they just don't want to look outside the box. But it seems like when you buy an Apple phone, it's still a property of Apple and not you. Apple is a marketing company. That's all they are. They're not a manufacturer. Apple, when you come up with the iPhone 6 or whatever the hell it is, make sure we can customize it. it it's, it's really bad for Apple to invent a $500 phone that you cannot customize. I mean, there's a lot of Apple fans out there. I realize that. But please do not waste your money on the iPhone 5 and this is going to sound you know a lot of people ain't going to believe this but it's really bad it's probably the worst iPhone released so far I find that the Apple iPhone series has been slipping for some time now okay I wasn't impressed with the iPhone 4 but the iPhone 5 they have made look absolutely terrible and I'm getting sick of Apple you know Apple sells on marketing and there's too many people out there who buy Apple products because Apple say so and I'm here to tell you all please do not buy Apple products they're absolutely terrible you know you're wasting your money on each and every one of them they're never good quality they're probably fall apart after a few months and that's not good that is not good and I'm sick of Apple and I'm sick of these people who go around saying you know Apple's the best you know these basement dwelling people they basically live in the basement I don't know where they live in the basement but I can imagine most Apple fans do Hey everyone, I don't know whether you know this or not, but the new Apple MacBook Pro 2012 with Retina Display really does suck. The new Retina Display absolutely sucks, okay? There's no difference between that and a standard display. What were they thinking? It's absolute rubbish. You know, you're paying all this money for something that's useless, to be honest. Please do not bother with this new MacBook Pro with Retina Display. You're just wasting your money. They just don't care about their customers, and that's going to hurt them huge. Like, Microsoft has been awesome to me. Any Microsoft pro product if I have a problem with, I can complain, and they will do something or at least try to work with me. Apple, they won't even respond to you. They will not take care of anything. 
they'll send you an auto reply email or a auto send basically through the mail and their refurbishing department won't take care of any of your uh, actual items. Apple, you suck! I used to be a PC fanboy, whatever, all right, and then I got the iMac because it was like a big screen, it was all built in one, supposed to be nice for multimedia, but Apple sucks because they can't fix anything. For the price, Apple isn't exactly a great deal for me. I don't like Apple, well, their pricing anyway, because they're very anti-enthusiast. Another thing with the pricing is that when you want to get an upgraded component from Apple, like say you want to upgrade from a 750 gigabyte hard drive to a 500 gigabyte SSD, that's going to run you about $400. A 500 gig SSD is usually $250, $300. If it's a Samsung SSD, you can get it for $250 on sale. If I go to the fucking store right now, if I go to, hell, not even Micro Center where they have the really good like value of parts plus 5% deals. If I go to Best Buy, one of the most overpriced electronics retailers in the entire country, and I go and I buy 8 gigs of, of crucial memory that's compatible with a Mac, that'll probably cost me 50 bucks, depending on the speed, instead of 200 That's four times the price for fucking memory. If you're an enthusiast, if you want the easy upgradability, the easy repairability, the easy addition and subtraction of functions and the control over what goes into your machine, you really don't, you don't want to go with Apple. You just don't. Apple fucking sucks. For $1,200, this is what you get. An outdated chip, minimal flash storage, and uh, nothing else. I don't know, a, head, a headphone port, USB 2.0. This is a piece of shit. Why would you ever buy this? I can just reiterate the same shit, and the Apple zombies of the world will line up before it even comes out, before even the specs are announced. It's like fucking Apple rip the fucking arse out of people for these slight memory increments. Fuck you, Apple. Apple's expensive, but cheap. Cheaply made. Apple sucks. I don't like Apple. It's expensive crap for nothing, really. I, Apple makes it so damn difficult to use their products and to give them money. It's ridiculous. I absolutely hate using shit tunes. Like, I, I cannot stand using iTunes. It gives me a headache, and it makes me want to throw up just thinking about it. Honestly, it does. Apple, get your shit together. You're a multi-billion dollar company, and it's ridiculous. I have to go to the ends of the earth to give you people money. Apple sucks. Ooh, look. I'm an apple. I'm an apple. Hey, apple, I'm an apple. Ha ha ha. Bye, apple. Piece of shit. Apple's the is the playground bully. You know, he's the playground bully who's got a couple of friends, thinks he's the most friendly person in the world, thinks everyone loves him, and when he sees one kid who's smarter and better looking than him, Seriously. he goes, he keeps, he keeps trying to punch that kid. Well, people yeah. have to stand up and sucker punch that bully in the stomach until that bully is laying on the ground and choking on his own vomit. That's what we have to do with Apple right now because they are they are the jerk jerk bully who has no skills, no talents and no ability to ever hold anything better than a fast food job at Jack in the Box or Taco Bell. Apple is irrelevant already other than everyone's pissed off at Apple. The problem is that Apple as a company is inherently bad and they've hit a point where they've attacked everyone and attacked everyone and stolen people's intellectual property and copied some of the great ideas people have had and now they're actually out and out suing other people for making stuff before Apple. Apple's bad, Apple's irrelevant, Android has bigger market share. I don't feel like if you're on the playground and you're a bunch of kids, you don't want to be the kid that goes around sucker punching people in the stomach. Dear Apple, what's the deal with your mice? You guys over at Apple have a long, gruesome history of awful, terrible, pathetic mice. Dear Apple, this is something not a lot of people know about. Your customer support isn't very good. Your technical support isn't very technical. Fuck you. Reverse one finger salute. Suck this apple. Oh, hi, I'm Apple. Oh, 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 I'm Apple. Oh, oh, I'm the consumer. I'm Apple. Oh, 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 oh. iPhone 5. It sucks. It's it's not a good phone. I don't I don't I don't think it's good at all. They keep upgrading their stuff. They're saying that they're every two months they say that they're gonna sell a new product from Apple. It sucks. I'm not a fan of Apple computer anymore. I. 
I hate to say this, but I hope the stock crashes. I hope they go out of business. And I will never buy a new iPhone unless I am completely guaranteed that I could use the old app for the rest of my life. Sadly, and I might, I might actually have to burn my kids' iPads and iPhones and all that other stuff because this is a game changer, kids. Are we going back to the future? Or are we going back to stupidity? Because the iPhone 5 has been released, and I've got one here. It might as well be, because it's about as fucking shit. No innovations. No fucking innovations. I dropped my phone one time. Like, I dropped it one time, and the screen shattered. And I'm like, first of all, why is this one made out of glass? And second, why is it so easily breakable? Like, you would think if they're making it out of some kind of glass, like fiber, maybe it wouldn't break so easy. But no, this shit, like, exploded. Like, it, like, erupted all over the floor. Hey guys, for you to let you know that Apple sucks. Yes, Apple does suck. Oh, iOS 5, it's so amazing. Now you can do stuff that Android people have been able to do for, like, years. Well, I got Lion. OS Lion. I, I fucking hate it. I hate it. It's the worst thing ever. Imagine how you're used to scrolling on your mouse. They inverted that. What is this, a fucking flight simulator? Why would I want that inverted? Like, like five minutes ago, I was scrolling normally, and now it's inverted. I guess it's because they want to make it more like a phone, so you like pull down and it goes down, but I'm not on a fucking phone. I'm on a, I'm on a track, I'm on a mouse with a fucking wheel that I've been using for years. Isn't it just like Steve Jobs just shoves something down your fucking throat when you don't want it? Another time a week ago I went to the Apple store, I was interested in updating my OS X Tiger to the, the one that's out now, which is Snow Leopard. They didn't have a clue. They didn't, it's like, I was talking to Brainless. Yeah, I have, I'm making a response video to Apple sucks. And it does not suck. You're just sad because you can't afford a freaking Apple computer. And the computers that you're holding are like ancient, they're dinosaurs, okay? Now, Apple has MacBook Airs, MacBook Pros, all made for specific reasons. You know what movies are made on now that you go to a movie theater and watch? On MacBook Pros, iMacs, all of that crap, okay? Do you know what the most common computer is? And used in movies or by the CIA and all that crap? And in, by investigators, all, everything? Apple. Apple, not PC, because they can't be typing a file report on a criminal and just have it break down on them. That's just stupid, okay? You cannot say that PC is a miracle worker and Apple sucks. Apple doesn't get viruses unless a PC gives it to them by an email or some stupid software that PC gives it. Like, Apple is indestructible, and you can even get software to stop any kind of viruses at all that you could get from a PC. What you just said is one of the most insanely idiotic things I have ever heard. At no point in your rambling, incoherent response were you even close to anything that could be considered a rational thought. Everyone in this room is now dumber for having listened to it. I award you no points and may God have mercy on your soul. Fuck, Mac. I hate Apple computers. They're too hard to use. They're complicated. The graphics are bad. There's a bite out of the logo. I don't understand why they can't afford a whole Apple. And what's an iTunes? I want my tunes. I don't want iTunes. It's grammatically incorrect. That company's retarded. I hate it and it's bad. The iPhone is a terrible phone. This really bugs me. Whatever it is with Apple, it seems like they want a total control over everything you do. It's like once you've bought an iPod, they own you. Apple have been stubborn ever since the beginning of time. How come every gosh darn product they sell look connected to the others? Point is, Samsung is committed to quality, and Apple is not. Apple is committed to charge the highest amount of price, have the cheapest amount of workers, and that make the cheapest amount of quality. And for Steve Jobs not to know what that was when he was talking about how Mac OS X now supported Kerberos, 
I thought it was completely unintelligent and completely, uh, you know, a great sign that Steve Jobs is an idiot. Don't buy iPhone. They're, they're complete garbage, I swear. Apple was so gay. Why does the 5S suck? Well, it's the same as the iPhone 5, except they've had a year to change it. And what have they done? They've added a dual LED flash. They've added a fingerprint reader, which doesn't work. <laughs> and they haven't changed the design at all. You know, I'm tired of Apple just making little subtle changes to their devices uh, every year. And then you have these crazy idiot fanboys that stand in line for this phone. Why would I want to buy a phone? that looks exactly the same as it did three years ago. I have a question for iPhone users. How the fuck do you type on this device? I don't know how. It's fucking impossible. Apple sucks. Apple sucks. Apple sucks. Apple sucks. Apple sucks. Apple sucks. Fuck you. Good night.